more of a runner. So we are starting out. Falcon versus Yoshi. You're talking about ripped? Oh, man. Sexy 64. Dude, I just <laughs> lost 10 pounds. I, you know, I gotta hit Hell up that. Yeah. I gotta hit up that pool. I gotta get some some sexy 64 picks in. But, um, on to the match. Uh, so we're gonna get Tacos as Yoshi, which I always really like to see. He plays. Oh man, that's tough. Tacos plays a, usually a pretty unique style of, of Yoshi. He really likes to triangle jump, as I like to say. Um, oh of, yeah. The, the reverse DJC fair to try and take space and, and throw out that huge hit box. Boom Boom knows all of the tricks and all of the Yoshi types and everything. Uh, nice little fake out there. Like that back air clearly, ooh, nice. That back air from Tacos didn't obviously hit anyone, but it, it sort of faked Boom out, right? It made him commit to something he didn't want to. Yeah. Uh, Nice conversion from Boom there, yeah. too. Something else that Tacos does that I like a whole lot, uh, the concept of not hitting your opponent, but hitting where they're going to be. Right. Like, uh, sometimes out of text, they'll just hop and do a, a fair and uh, catch their jump. Right, yeah. Oof. So that's that's a big risk. Going for that forward air on, on Falcon is tough, because if they up smash you and you double jumped, you might have lost your stock. An easy conversion here. Yep. I like the game that Tacos is trying to play at least, and, and his movement has looked really crisp, using his double jump armor there to his advantage. But Boom just so patient, able to find like the small openings. Yeah. It's going to be tough. Nice parry. Nice parry. Ah, uh, but then just sort of up smashes. Uh, yeah. I don't know if he wanted to move forward and up smash or he wanted to do something else. But Great recovery, but no jump here. Yeah. That's going to be an easy first game for Super Moon Man. Yeah. We'll see if he sticks to Yoshi. I, I, I still like his Yoshi movement. I think his Yoshi is unique enough that if he's trying, if Takos is trying to pull an upset, maybe his Yoshi is, is one of his better options here. Yeah. I don't think playing like a standard Pika or Falcon or maybe Puff. Okay, we'll see it. Hey, it worked out for Karo, so might see something a little better here. Yeah, I think, like I said, I think Yoshi, Takos' Yoshi is unique enough that he might get the jump on Boom, but Boom is also so smart in that matchup, it's tough to see how he's going to convert off that. So I like the Puff. You know, he just needs to find his, like, Get the right forward throw, and even Boom will lose his stock. Even Boom can play it. But the neutral in this matchup, I must say, is not great for Puff, especially at the highest level. Falcon has such quick movement, it's really difficult for Puff to be able to choose. You sort of have to predict and just throw out a hitbox where you think they're going to be. Yeah. Which is uh, not really what you want to be doing, <laughs> ideally. Ooh, nice ducks here. Yeah, it looked for oh, the reset. Yeah, yeah, that's smart. The slow walk and Nair, yeah. officer Nair, okay. So he knows, unlike unlike what he did with Kiro, I think he knew if he rested Boom there, he was going to lose the stock yeah. 10 times out of 10. There's no way he was going to miss that. And that duck a little again. bit of a flub from Boom. That duck is hard to deal with from Falcon. Mm. And the nice flow chart at edge guard here. I, I really like that Nair choice. After he realized that Boom had teched, away out towards the edge he got the hard nair to be able to knock him off stage that's really big because and there's that dare beating out Ooh, uh, misses the upper yep. yeah so right boom boom knowing that tacos has been crouching even there right off that tech you saw tacos immediately crouch and boom immediately down there he knew exactly what tacos wanted it wanted it wanted that's he, what he wanted what he wanted it what he wanted it Sometimes I just need to say so many words at once that I add so those words. And uh, Boom really <laughs> flexing the dares Really now. showing what a down air can do against Puff. Oh my gosh. This is messy. I've actually, like, I, I, I've i played Falcons where they've just done this to me. It's, it feels bad. Yes. <laughs> Ooh. Tricky little up B there. Yeah, quick conversion. Uh, oh, missed the turnaround there. If you got that turnaround grab, that could have been a stock, but... Uh, Boom so fast. I don't know if he would have gotten it on time anyway. Nice uh, catch on Taco's landing from Boom there. Yeah. And uh, you're going to want that trade every time. Yeah. Yep. That's a tough one. Yeah, if you trade on that with Puff, you've lost your largest second double jump. Yes. And that's... Yeah, that, that, that can be curtains, especially against someone like Boom. You really have to get a trick play after that on your recovery. Maybe Taco's Taco's searching. pushing off again. 
soul searching really. I guess I, I don't know if I want to see the DK. Okay, all right. Okay, Falcon Dittos. I, I, and Yoshi. Okay, all right. I like Tagus' DK. I think DK Falcon is absolute trash. It's okay, rough. so back to the Yoshi. Oh, nice down tilt. Not Ta even opting for a combo. Tacos has pulled big up. Of course, I can't think of any of them right now, but I know that I've commentated a Tacos upset match with his Yoshi. And I, I, I feel like the way Yoshi's a, a character that lends itself to very different styles and is one of those characters that like sometimes even if you're really familiar with the matchup you play someone who plays really weirdly or really differently and you're like well damn I don't know this matchup at all yeah so he opts yeah. to send him to plat instead of sending him off stage with that effort um, not sure I agree with it but still kind of riding the momentum off that hit nice good, option good edge guard there from Tacos and it's even stocks He's got to get out of the corner. Okay, good. Yeah. Yoshi not the fastest, shall we say? But <laughs> yeah, um, it's interesting. His initial dash is fast. A yeah. little. It's all is right, it? but he's got that weird oh. like kind of uh, warm up to his to his run. Tagos unfortunately like sort of ends up off stage there and finds himself edge guarded. If he can convert this, yep. Yeah, no jump here. Uh, oh, he can. He can. Oh. Nice. So you saw that? I saw that from Tacos earlier, especially with DK. Tacos likes to do running turnaround. The slow animation and gets the, the first frame of the jump he can get. That he's turned around. It's really strange. Um, I think it's better with DK than it is with Yoshi. I think Yoshi's animation is slow. Ooh, interesting down air there, but... Still continuing it. What a combo from Tacos. Uh, unfortunately, that... Tacos gets a huge percentage combo there, but in this matchup, it's really about the kills, not the percent, yeah. right? Like, what is a 120% Falcon going to do? Like, yeah, there we go. All right. Yeah, you kind of see a difference in style than, say, like, Wizrobe, whose goal is to hit Falcon and up smash as soon as possible to get him off stage. Right. He, yeah, he's definitely not a Wizrobe Yoshi. They play extremely different. Yes. Similar levels of play. Right, you know, yeah, they've, they've had similar results. Uh, oh, man. That's sad. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know what to say about that one. Yeah. <laughs>